Okay, so let's talk about pinning, how we would pin different items to hangers. Okay, so you wanna make sure, just use the two and a half or three inch safety pins, that'll, that'll be easier for you. Um, the littler is, ones are so hard to, to yeah, bend around. You the... can do it, but it just it's just a little bit harder on your fingers. You definitely don't want to ever use these little tiny gold ones because they don't stay. They pop easily. But So you want to use a good size safety pin. Just go through one side first, then the next side. But you do need to go through both, both edges. Because okay. yeah. if you only go through one side, it just gapes open and other hangers get stuck in there. Sure. And then you don't, you don't want to go to the side here because then it falls to the bottom of the hanger, which we don't want that. Now, will these pins make a permanent hole in the fabric? Um, no, safety pins are actually made for fabric, so that's a good um, question. You wanna make sure that, um, I, I try to go through a waistband, so that will help. Down just a little bit. That, that will ensure that there's not a hole made. And if a safety pin does leave a tiny hole, that it washes out uh, when, you, when you wash the Oh, hand. sure, okay, yes. that makes sense. Yes. Where tag guns, we'll talk about that later, tag guns leave a permanent hole. Okay. And and like you said before, you don't want to you don't want to pin them down here. Yes. Like this, because they could they could slide around there. See, this is the one that's done incorrectly. And now see how it slides. And the one at the top, it just stays nicely. Nice. If somebody picks up the item, it doesn't slide around. It stays so that people can see the front and see that the, the price tag too. Perfect. So what if I'm using a clip hanger like this? Do I need to also pin? No, nope. with the clip hanger, see how that's really secure? If, if, it, if it's not a good clip where you feel like it's gonna fall off, but if you pull on it just a bit and it doesn't fall off, then this is, this is good to go. Great. These are a lot easier. If you can find these, grab them. So what about a two-piece set like a like a pants and a shirt type of set Okay, this here. is, uh, sometimes people will put two hangers together and rubber band them. Let me show you a trick where you can just use one hanger. Again, you want to go through both edges of the waistband. I usually go one at a time, just so you don't poke yourself. Sometimes they're pretty thick, yeah. Yes, and then you go, you want to wrap around the hanger to give it stability. See how I went through the shirt, but I also went up to the top of the hanger, so then it gives it stability. What some people do is they just go through the shirt mm -hmm like that, and that's where you could have a problem if somebody pulled on it too hard. See how this is being stabilized by the hanger? You could right. have a problem with the shirt getting pulled on and leaving a hole. So don't ever do that. You wanna go around, wrap it around the hanger, and then it gives it support, and then you only need to use one hanger in this case. And and these bigger pins leave you plenty of room to, to do that. Yes. And there is a link on, on the website, and we'll put it in this video, too, of where to get these safety pins. Great. Now, if I use a hanger uh, from a store like this, would I want to reinforce this with a safety pin? Um, you're good. See how it has the little indent? Okay, so this would be this would be okay. And yes. I guess just sometimes, if you feel like it's insecure, yes. you just use another just use use a safety pin. Yes. It's okay. Yeah. But most of the time, if you get the correct size hanger and um, it has indents like that, you're going to be good. And I think we want to talk about, too, uh, something I forgot to mention with the two-piece set. The, the hanger needs to make the question mark as for the shirt, like yes. as you're looking at So if the you're shirt. looking at it, see how this um, looks like a question mark, so it's facing to the left side as you're looking at it. The, the opening is facing to the left. Okay, the opening faces the left. So yes. when you put the pants on, the hanger will be backwards, but yes, yes. they're going to hang, hang like that. Yes, so. all the hangers Great. face left. All right. That makes it easier for our shoppers.